All right, yeah, I know. Okay, I'm late. All right, I know, I know, I know. I don't want to hear it. Okay, I don't want to freaking hear it. I know I'm late. I know this video's really behind. We're just gonna get into it. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay, I'm sorry. All right, let's let's move on. Okay then, this box right here. You know it already. It's Aki Bento monthly subscription box filled with anime. Absolute brim. You you know how it goes. Okay, anyways, this box is from May, and I believe the the theme for this was fierce. And I don't exactly remember what was in fierce. I know I'm pretty sure One Piece was in there. Maybe Fairy Tale. Uh. Yeah, we're, we're behind, boys. We're behind. I also have the box for June right here. We'll be opening that up after this one. But yeah, this is May. This is Fierce. Woo! Money shot! Hell yeah! Ooh, whoa. Okay, something's on the top that's not the shirt. We're going for the shirt first, as always, boys. Ooh, it's a gray shirt. Let me uh, take a look at it here before I show ye. Ooh, I actually like the look of that a lot. All right, let me show you what we're going with here. All right, so as you can see, it appears we have some sort of bird. I'm not exactly sure what that's from, but then we have the guy from Demon or er, Goblin Slayer, Goblin Slayer, I believe, and then we've also got Sanji up there having a shirt with Sanji on. It's super cool. Big fan of One Piece. But yeah, we've got Sanji and Goblin Slayer, and then some sort of bird. Really like it. It's it's a gray shirt, but uh, this particular shirt they have right here is probably one of the softest shirts I own. A lot of Akibento shirts have went up in quality over the years, which is super nice. But yeah, I really like the design. Really like the color. Already 100% satisfied, and we haven't even gotten to the rest of the box yet. So let's grab this other thing that's right on top here. It is the Akibento exclusive drawstring backpack. We've gotten a couple of these before. I'll open it up real quick so you don't have to listen to this packaging through the mic. Ooh, ooh, okay. Yo, so I was right. It was Fairy Tale. So we've got Goblin Slayer, One Piece, and Fairy Tale right there. Natsu Luffy, and then the Goblin Slayer guy, and it says fierce so i was right about the theme as well this is actually really cool drawstring bags are you know something good if you're going to like a, a concert a convention just something to carry your stuff around in or you know going to the pool love these things i love the design on this i wasn't super sure about the color at first but i think it all blends super well together that red black and brown orange ish color right there hell yeah boys bro this box is already super fire i apologize i couldn't get this one to you guys earlier all right, moving back to the box, I actually see something super exciting on the top here, and it is Nico Robin in pop figure form. There you go. Look at that. Oh, yeah. So, Nico Robin is my undisputed number one waifu of all time. Number one. So, naturally, you'd think I'd be super excited about this, but I actually already own a Nico Robin Funko Pop. So, uh, I think we're gonna have to do a giveaway for this one, but I am not gonna give it away right now, because I'm gonna be in the process of moving soon, and... Things get pretty chaotic during the move, if you know what I'm saying. So, I will be giving this away in a future Ecumento unboxing. So, maybe hit that subscribe button, smack the like. I'll, I'll tell you how you can possibly win this in the future. Okay? Okay, cool. Punk. Oh, it, we're three for three. Good stuff right now. Hell yes, boys. Reaching back in, what do we have here? We have a keychain from Fairy Tale. All right, so as you can see, it is a uh, Natsu and Happy in a uh, uh, keychain form. Pretty cool. I'm not going to be getting it out, but, you know, something cool to, to show the boys. Keychains are always a, a good side item. I'd much rather have a keychain than a sticker, if you know what I'm saying. So, heck yeah. Okay, back into the box. We have some sort of cube right here. The uh, Akibento Magic Cube Puzzle. Let's see what we got on the inside. Okay, so uh, it, it is a Poneglyph. If you are unfamiliar with One Piece, you probably won't know what that is, but... It is a, indeed a Poneglyph. You can see the, the different uh, markings on there. At least I would assume it's a Poneglyph because this is a One Piece themed. Oh, okay. So it, it opens up this way and you can see uh, we've got some sort... What is that right there? Oh, it's the uh, a pirate ship out in the, uh, in the distance and getting some waves. And uh, what happens after this? Does, that, does this go further? Does this open up? Oh, it has to open up even more because there's something on the ends there. Oh, it opens up a different way. Okay, so now we have the Straw Hats throwing their hands in the air like they just don't care. <laughs> so as you can see, it also opens up this way as well. We get ourselves a, a treasure chest. Perhaps that is the One Piece confirmed? But yeah, that's definitely a, a cool little knickknack right there, I gotta say. Let's zoom this back out. But yeah, this is a, a cool little knickknack. Uh, heck yeah, best exclusives in the game as always, you know what I mean? Alright, but we're not done yet, boys. We still got something else in here. What is this now? The Acubento exclusive a bookmark? Hey! Yeah, that sounds cool, you know, because I, I read a lot of manga. I need something to keep my place in there. All right, so as you can see there, it is uh, the Goblin Slayer guy. He's also got his, you know, his tassels from his helmet. 
and it's just you know a bookmark slides into the page like that pretty cool could definitely could use a bookmark and this is a, a fancy one you hear that that's how you know it's a of the aluminum quality right there uh that might be everything in the box so let me uh double check could be something hiding in there like a uh, sticker oh no we still got the pin and that does appear to be it so let's, let's take a look at that pin right quick boys Woo! yeah alrighty so there is the Acubento fierce pin and it appears to have the Acubento original character with the straw hat all right so now that appears to be everything in the box so let's take a look inside the pamphlet shall we Woo! all right so we've got the fierce artwork on the front and then if we turn it over to the back we've got some people taking some selfies and then on the inside we of course have the selfie contest which is way over by now then on the inside for the items we have the fairy tale keychain the exclusive fierce metal bookmark the exclusive fierce ancient magic puzzle cube the exclusive fierce drawstring bag one of five One Piece Funko Pops, so we could have got any of the five here. Nico Robin, Sanji, Boa Hancock, Usopp, or Doflamingo. Then we have the Acubento Monthly Pin and the exclusive Fierce T-Shirt. So, where would I rank this box compared to the other boxes I've opened? Well, I have to uh, do this real quick. Hell yes, boys! Terrible the haters! We didn't get any stickers! Woo! That's... Is that two for two on these boxes, or did we get stickers last time? I don't remember, because I'm a pleb, and it's been a while, and we're very late. But yeah, no stickers in this box. That is automatically a big thumbs up from your boy. I would say this is just, you know, a very standard good box, really. I mean, we got a good Funko Pop. The drawstring bag is very cool. I quite like the design on the shirt. The puzzle cube is a good little knick-knack. And then, of course, the b fucking hell, dog. Fucking hell, dog! The, the bookmark's cool, and the keychain is just a nice little addition. Everything is great. It's a thumbs up for me. I mean, I do think we've had better boxes, but this was a very good one. Very good. It's, it's definitely top tier. I think I'm going to rank this one above Universe, but below Clash. If you want to see where that's at on my list, you can check the description down below. Best at the top, worst at the bottom, and everything in between. Once again, great box today. Very happy with it. Uh, the thing is, um, the June box is already out because it's, it's, it's right here. So we should probably talk about July, I guess, because when you're watching this video, the July box will be the one that you can, you know, possibly pick up. So the theme for July is going to be Bonds, featuring items from Haikyuu, Ancient Magus Bride, and Kamisama Kiss. If that sounds interesting to you, well, feel free to check that description down below if you want to, you know, pick one of them up. But if you want to know more about prices and everything like that, let me tell you about it right now. If you're interested in getting yourself one of these boxes, the first thing you're going to want to do is follow the link in the description, which will take you to their website. While you're there, you can select either the one month, three month, or six month plan. The one month is $26.95, the three month is $26.50, and the six month is $26 per box. So you save a little bit selecting the higher plans, but the savings aren't massive or anything. Also, as of right now, Akibento is currently running the coupon code ANIME, which will give you $3 off your your first box. So if you went with the one month plan, you'd be paying just under $30 with shipping. Like I said earlier, each month has a unique theme, so there's lots of cool stuff on the way, and each box comes with an exclusive t-shirt and pin, and there will be six to eight items in each box. You're also guaranteed to get about a $60 value worth of items in each box, so you pay almost $30 to get $60 or more worth of anime goodies. Sounds way too good to pass up if you ask me. So if any of that sounds interesting, to you. Make sure to pick up one of these boxes before it's too late. How's it going everybody? It is your man Mr. Skeletal here once again. Amazing box today. Hell yes. Uh, Nico Robin's not really my bae, but I can respect it. I can respect it. Good on you too, Spooky. But anyways, yeah, great box. Click up here for the previous unboxing and I know it's been a while. I've been trying to remind Spooky, but he sucks. Or click down here for a random one. Appreciate you guys. I will see you in the next unboxing. Woo, yeah!